Hey Chapter Officers, I'm Brennan Costello serving this year as the Central Region Vice President. I'm Kaylee Hall serving as Secretary. And we get to bring you the first episode of Officer to Officer. So you may be wondering, what is Officer to Officer? Well, it's really our first chance for our officer team to have a conversation with your officer team. We're just going to talk about some exciting things going on at National FFA, some opportunities you can get involved with, and how to become great chapter officers. So on this first episode of Officer to Officer, we're going to talk about two things. National FFA Week, give a recap of that, and talk about the Washington Leadership Conference. I'll take FFA Week. This year, FFA Week ran from February 16th to the 23rd with the theme of Grow, and our national officer team got to see a lot of growing happen happening in FFA chapters across the nation. This year is, marks the 66th anniversary of National FFA Week since it started in 1947. And chapters, this is a chance for you to show um, some appreciation for the supporters of the FFA, to promote the FFA, and to promote the agricultural industry. We saw some teacher appreciation breakfasts. We saw some Ag Olympic events going on, some, some uh, members participating in community service activities, and even a rally to fight hunger. Uh, we were very impressed and wanted to say um, from our team to your, your team how proud we were for the opportunities and the activities that we saw going on around the nation during National FFA Week. This year, we also had the chance to partner with two sponsors, a tractor supply company and Southern States. At Tractor Supply Company, they held a can-do drive where chapters um, brought in canned goods um, to promote the FFA and to fight hunger. Then with these canned goods, they made a, a creative sculpture like a barn or a corn stalk or anything in between about how we can promote the FFA and fight hunger in our local communities. Southern States also held a fundraiser for local chapters. They handed out and sold uh, paper FFA emblems. Um, which all the funds from those went to uh, local chapters, which we really appreciated the support from our sponsors during National FFA Week. Now, we are very proud of what happened during National FFA Week. However, this month, we also have the chance to continue what we started in National FFA Week. March is National Ag Appreciation Month, and it comes to a climax during March 19th, which is Ag Appreciation Day. And we challenge your officer teams to get your members involved in, in efforts to continue to promote the agricultural industry. Maybe there's some things you didn't get accomplished during National FFA Week, or some things that you still want to do to help promote agriculture in your local communities. March 19th, or all of March in, in National Ag Appreciation Month, is a chance to do that. So think of some more ways that you can continue to promote agriculture in your local community. The living to serve is the last line of our FFA motto. But what does that even mean? I discovered what this means on a little journey that I took during my sophomore year as an FFA member. I hopped on a bus and went into a hotel room with three other girls I had never met before in my life. I really did not know what I was getting into. It turns out you'd be surprised how much you can have in common with three other girls from Michigan, Washington State, and Georgia that you've never met when you're all FFA members. And that week, we spent the entire week in Washington, D.C., learning what it means to live to serve, and not in some stuffy classroom at school, but actually in our nation's capital, going to monuments, touring things around the city, and getting to know exactly what is our purpose and how can we be involved in serving a need in our homes and communities. For me, that meant going back to an elementary school and working with an after-school program, playing in the dirt with seven- and eight-year-olds. Lots of fun. You can have the same opportunity to discover, what, to discover what it means to live to serve by attending the Washington Leadership Conference this summer. So the Washington Leadership Conference is a week-long conference with FFA members all across the country. Get a chance to meet them, to learn what it means to serve with purpose, and to have lots of fun and take lots of pictures along the way. And it starts right now. We have to start registering right now. So go online to the FFA website at www.ffa.org and click under the WLC tab. And under WLC, you can find a video, stories from past participants so you know what you're getting yourself into just a little bit. And there's also some fundraising ideas that might be helpful to you as you begin your journey to go to Washington Leadership Conference this summer. We want to thank you uh, for tuning in to this episode of Officer to Officer. Kayla and I um, really appreciate getting the chance to send a message right to your chapter officer team. 
We hope that you will check out the links below and really get involved in what you can do in March during National Ag Appreciation Month or get involved with the Washington Leadership Conference. Kaylee and I also invite your questions. If you have a question about something going on in your team, something that National FFA is doing or anything else in between, please tweet your questions to National FFA with hashtag O2O or submit them to O2O at FFA.org. Please submit your questions. Maybe we'll get to answer them in the next version of Officer to Officer. We hope you'll get involved with WLC and happy National Ag Appreciation Month. Thank you, guys.